The Hellenic Trench is one of the most important ecological areas in the Mediterranean and in Greece, as it hosts a number of species, uh, such as, uh, for example, 12 uh, cetacean species, whales and dolphins, including sperm whales, fin whales, cuvier beaked whales and other dolphins. Once you know where the animals are, you can define blue corridors and inside these corridors you can suggest ships to slow down, you can avoid oil and gas exploitation, you can have other marine traffic reducing their speed and paying more attention to animals. So there are a lot of things you can do once you know where the animals are and how they're using these corridors. So the threats for this region is a few. So we have growing ship traffic along the Hellenic Trench, which are a risk for uh, beaked whales and sperm whales that use sounds to, to feed and to forage, to navigate and communicate. Uh, but also there's risk of ship strikes. Uh, we have uh, the risk of oil and gas offshore uh, is incredibly risky to develop in the Hellenic Trench, and that's something we don't want to see. So the Greek government recently at the Our Ocean Conference took this pledge to expand the marine protected area coverage in Greece. One of the parks that was announced is the park in the Ionian region. Now this is an important piece of news for us, but most of the parks in Greece are actually paper parks. So a lot of work still needs to be done to make effective management measures be put in place. For a place like Hellenic Trench, there's also a very important piece of information, the elephant in the room in this place is oil and gas exploration. So there are a number of concessions that have been signed before the announcement of this marine park and we're working hard to ensure that these concessions will actually be cancelled because oil and gas and MPAs don't mix.